Story time! It's time for Cheery Kicks Up Training. There's Cheery right there with Bayo. Cheery looks like this. Have you seen her? She's that awesome cheetah. Yes, she is a hard worker. Let's find out about her and her story. So Bayo was very excited to get to his tiger class. He had a big weekend. Do, 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 do. He had just competed in his first tournament and he won a participation medal. It was bright and shiny. <laughs> and he had wore he wore it around his neck. He couldn't wait to show his friends. You see him right there? He has that participation medal, or they call it a competitor's medal. Awesome. When Bayo arrived at class, only Cheery was there. She was already on the floor practicing her form. Twin into form block, punch, punch, devil out of form block, round kick, we were side kick, back for strike, yeah. She looked very serious. Yes, she's pretty serious, you can see. Hi, Cheery, Bayo said. I saw you at the tournament this weekend. How'd you do? I won a competitor medal. Check it out. Cheery didn't stop, to pra stop practicing to look, but said coldly, I won first place. Wow, Bayo said. That medal must be awesome. Can I see it? Cheery replied, hmm, I didn't bring it. You can see they're, t they're talking as she's doing her form. Bayo thought she looked sad. Did you lose it already? I lose stuff all the time. No, I didn't lose it. I'm just not that happy with it, Cheery replied. Why not? Bayo asked. Because my scores should have been better, she snarled. How can your scores be better than first place? Yeah, Cheery, how is that possible? Bayo said confused. You just don't get it because you don't take anything seriously. Cheery said harshly as she turned away to continue her practice. Ooh. Cold shoulder. Here they are getting into a, a nice conversation. Bayo was upset for her. She had won first place but didn't seem all that excited. It wasn't any fun to win and still not be happy about it. He thought as he put his gear bag in his cubby and got ready for class. The next class, Bayo arrived early again. It was report card day. His grades hadn't been very good lately. Ooh, ooh. Cheery was there too, and she was on the floor practicing as usual. Yeah, yeah. She looked angry again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess you didn't get good grades either, Bayo said. <laughs> I received all A's, she said, not even looking at him. And you're still not happy with that? Why? Because they're not A pluses? I'd be jumping up and down. Woohoo! You just don't get hard work, do you, Cheery Grumped? There's Cheery. She's a bit of an overachiever, isn't she? Master Jiangsu had heard enough. Chitty, Bayo, come here, he said. Yes, sir! They yelled and ran over. Master Jiangsu spoke firmly. I would like for you two to work together to today. Chitty, you are to help Bayo study his schoolwork. Bayo, you are to help Chitty practice her form. Both Cheery and Bayo were confused. Huh? He doesn't take work seriously, Cheery said. And she is always practicing her form. She knows it better than I do. What can I show her? Who are you talking to? Bayo added, I am confident that both of you will find strengths to help each other, Master Jiangsu said. Now go! Here they are talking to Master Jiangsu. Huh, I wonder how they're going to help each other out. Bayo is pretty confused. I think Cheery's just a little upset. Bayo and Cheery sat in the homework room. Cheery had a pile of books in front of her. She was studying away. Bayo had only one book covering his face. 
He, she looked very serious as she started her spelling work. Bayo popped his head out of his book, poop, with two pencils out of his mouth, hanging down like fangs. Look, I'm a vampire. <laughs> Cheery didn't laugh. If you don't take things seriously, you'll never learn, she frowned. You see the two pencils out of his mouth? And she doesn't look very happy down here, does she? After a boring hour of homework, they decided to take a break from studying to practice Cheery's form. She did it one time. And it looks good and strong. But Bayo noticed something. I really like your power, but you could smile a bit. He said, what? Cheery said, Taekwondo isn't about smiling. It's about pew, kicking. Bayo replied, but if you don't have any fun while you're kicking, then why do it? That's a very good point. You should probably enjoy it while you do it. You see that, Cheery and Bayo? Bayo is making sure she's smiling. She needs to turn that frown upside down. I have an idea. Why don't we play a game? Bayo ran and grabbed a ball. I'll throw this to you and you see if you can round kick it, he said excitedly. Well, that just sounds silly, Cheery said. That's exactly the point, Bayo replied. She thought about it for a moment and then said, Fine, but every time you throw the ball, you have to spell one of your words correctly first. Deal! S-N-O-K-E-L. Snorkel. He then threw the ball and Cheery blasted it with a round kick. Whoosh, boom. The ball went flying, sending it right back to him. I caught it. I bet I can get the next one over your head. Oh, that was Cheery. Cheery said, I bet you I can get the next one over your head. <laughs> she said with a small little smile on her face. Oh, yeah? R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Respect! Ha-ha! <laughs> Bayo exclaimed, and he threw the ball again. This time, whoosh, it went sailing over Bayo's head. The ball went over his head. They both laughed <laughs> and played their new game all the way through Bayo's spelling list. There's Bayo spelling respect. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Find out what it means to me. The next class, Bayo was super excited again. He couldn't wait to show Master Jiangsu his spelling test. He ran into the school. I got a 100! Of course, Cheery was already there practicing as usual. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. But this time she looked a little different. She was smiling. Good job on the 100 and check this out. Boom! She said as she did a round kick. My kick is higher. I guess that game worked for both of us. Yahoo! Look at them, they're both so happy. Bayo got 100% A+, plus, and Cheery is kicking a little higher and a little stronger. Master Jiangsu overheard and called them over. And why do you both think you dis succeeded? He asked. Bayo said, well, sir, I guess for me, Cheery showed me that maybe if I wanted something bad enough, I would have to focus on it. It's pretty good. We all know we need to focus. We got to focus. Cheery added, and Bayo showed me that even when I work hard, I should still remember to have some fun. And what did you learn together, Bayo and Achiri? To make good friends. Yay, that's a good story. There is still some time before class, Master Jiangsu said. I would like to work on my round kicks too. Bayo, do you have any spelling words? Yes, sir, he said as he ran to get the ball. And then they played until class was ready. That's a good story. Yes, 
you should work hard. Yes, you need to stay focused. But more importantly, yes, I want you to smile and have fun along the way. Okay? And enjoy every moment. Enjoy your day with your parents. You got it, Bayo? Well, Bayo, I think you enjoy a lot. Bayo, you need to focus. Yes, sir. And Cheery? Yes, sir. You need to smile. Okay? Have some more fun. Here. Here's a crossword for you. Or I guess it's not a crossword. It's actually just a word find. So there are the words. I'm going to send you a picture. Or you can freeze frame this and see if you can find the words discipline, belief, communication, respect, self-esteem, honesty, songam, tigers, and chigo. Oh, wow. That's a big word. All right. Well, there you have it. I've got a couple more books coming soon. And then I have some more special books that I'm going to read for you. Until then, have a good night.